Okay, good morning, boys and girls. Um, so we finished our live meeting, and I didn't record it because I wanted to make sure that everybody could see the book. Um, so I'm going to record this one. I'm going to post it, but it's the same read aloud that I did with the rest of the kids um, that were on the live call. And so then that way you guys aren't missing out. Um, so our read aloud today is called The Bike Lesson. It is written and illustrated by Stan and Jan Berenstein. And this is actually a book that I had when I was in first grade. So it's a really old book. And I always like to read you guys my favorite stories. So come here, small bear. Here's something you will like. Look, Ma, look, a brand new bike. Thanks, Dad, thanks. For me, you say, I'm going to ride it right away. Not yet, not yet, not yet, my son. First come the lessons, then the fun. How to get on is lesson one. Oh, I did not do a good job. Lesson one, is that lesson one? Yes, that's what you should not do. So let that be a lesson to you. Yes, it was, Dad, now I see. That was a very good lesson for me. Dad, where are you going? You showed me how. Why don't you let me write it now? Not yet, not yet. Before you do, I have to give you lesson two. Just watch, small bear. Just watch your pop. Lesson two is how to stop. It says, I'm looking. Here goes the road, and I see something in the way. Oof, a very good lesson. Thank you, Pop. May I write it now, now that you showed me how? May I, may I, may I write it now? Not yet, not yet. You have more to learn. I'll have to show you how to turn. Just watch me. This is lesson number three. here and then bam wow what a lesson that number three that might be a little too hard for me this is what you must never do now let that be a lesson to you it surely was dad now I see that was a very good lesson for me when I get you down may I write it then may I may I just say when. Wait, son, you must learn some more. I have yet to teach you lesson four. When you come to a puddle, what will you do? Will you go around or will you ride right through? Not so good to ride right through. You're right, Dad, I can clearly see that was a very good lesson for me. When I get you out, may I write it then? Will you, will, oops, please dad, will you tell me when? Of course you may write it, you can, you will. After lesson five, how to go downhill. Wow, what a lesson, that looks hard, going downhill through a chicken yard. Angry chickens, cows flying, farmers flying, spilling the milk. Not good. Please, Dad. Dad, please tell me, will I ever get to ride it or will I just keep running beside it? So we've got angry farmers and a cow and the chickens running. Oh, they're hiding under the bridge. Will I, will I, will I win? Pretty soon, son, but not just yet. There's still one lesson you have to get. Lesson six is the hardest yet. 
To be a good writer, to really know how, you have to learn about safety now. I think in the safety probably should have been the first thing. To be safe, small bear, when you ride a bike, you can't just take any road you like. Before one, you take one, you must know. Where that road is gonna go. See, this is what you should not do. Now let that be a lesson to you. It surely was, Dad. Now I see that was another good lesson for me. May I write it now? May I write it now? After one more lesson, and it'll be the last, there's one more thing, and I can teach it fast. When I ride on a road, I take great pride in always riding on the right-hand side. But Dad, are you riding on the right-hand side? I guess I know my hand, small bear. My right is here, my left is there. Or am I wrong? Now, could that be left hand, right hand? Let me see. Left hand on the left-hand side, right hand on the right-hand side. Thank you, Pop, you showed me how, but please, 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 may I write it now? Look, Ma, now I can write it. See, Dad had some very good lessons for me. The end. Okay, so. Put this to the side, and I'm going to grab my spiral notebooks. I want you to grab your spiral notebooks. Um, you're going to put the date up here at the top. So today is September 16th, 2020. Then I want you to draw a little rectangle. So this is where your illustration is going to go. Um, and then down here in the space below, I want you to tell me about how either you learned to ride a bike or um, someplace you've ridden your bike or any, any kind of things about, about your bike. And if you don't have a bike um, and you wish you had a bike, maybe tell me about what kind of bike you would like, what color, um, that kind of thing, okay? So um, you're gonna do an illustration that matches your sentences and I would like you to tell me all about riding your bike, okay? You could bring it with you. Those of you that are coming into class tomorrow, um, you can tear the paper out and bring it with you so I can take a look and see what you did. If you are one of our at-home classmates, um, you're gonna, you'll send it back either with your work today or send it back with your work for next Wednesday is fine, okay? And then I'll take a look and I'll see how you're doing writing your sentences. And after those of you that are working at home, I would like to... Um, be able to go through and give you some feedback. So tell you what, I, what I'm seeing. So when you're writing your sentences, remember your capital letters, remember your spacing, remember your punctuation, okay? So, um, so those are all the things that we're working on. Remember our rules for our sentences, okay? So that's what you're gonna work on today. Next week um, is when we'll start doing some science activities on Wednesdays too. Um, or, or just different kind of kind of different projects than, than what we would do on a normal class day, okay? Um, so that's all. So I will see you guys later. Thank you.